we live in dark times. Reactionary ideologies have spread like wildfire across the globe. The fabric of American society is rapidly unraveling under a sustained barrage of mass shootings, terrorism, and other acts of paramilitary violence. Across the West, populist politicians have fanned the flames of nationalism and division through toxic rhetoric and sustained attacks on migrants, women, Muslims, indigenous communities, black communities, Roma, trans folks, queers, and anyone else that those in power can get away with blaming for a problem entirely of their own making. For an endless present in which the vast majority of us suffer increasing levels of economic, social, and spiritual impoverishment, also that a shrinking class of parasites can further enrich themselves at our expense. The intense alienation of modern society has provided ample fuel for the purveyors of misinformation, spawning a new paradigm of social control premised upon a perpetually shifting haze of smoke, mirrors, and cries of fake news. The new science of social engineering uses sophisticated technologies and hidden algorithms to manipulate people's emotions and weaponize their consumer preferences, personal prejudices, and past experiences, playing multiple sides against one another in a true masterstroke of divide and rule. This torrent of carefully curated lies, half-truths, and corporate infotainment is meant to keep us distracted, angry, and ignorant of the possibilities of collective resistance. But for those who care to look, resistance is everywhere. Our goal here at Submedia is to help shine a light on some of that resistance. From struggles against the extractive industry waged by the Wet'suwet'en and the Mi'kmaq on their colonially occupied territories, to the anti-gentrification struggles waged by working class people in cities around the world. From efforts to disrupt fascist networks and organizations, to anti-police riots and efforts to liberate territory from the logic of the market and transform it into zones of fledgling autonomy. We believe that independent, grassroots media has an important role to play in focusing attention on these stories of resistance, which are all too often purposefully ignored, condemned, or otherwise downplayed by corporate, state and NGO-sponsored media outfits. By doing so, we hope to foster conversations on tactics, strategy, and analysis that ultimately strengthen our movements. This is a responsibility that we take extremely seriously. We are a small collective of determined anarchist filmmakers who strive to punch above our weight by consistently producing high-quality content on a shoestring budget. Because we do not accept money from advertisers or corporate sponsors, we are funded entirely by our viewers, either through one-time donations, monthly sustainers, or the sale of merchandise. This also means that our work is deprioritized by social media algorithms in favor of content that they can earn more money off of. If you have been seeing less of our posts on your social media feeds, you may want to consider signing up for our regular newsletter so that you can have our videos delivered directly to your inbox. Over the years, we've been truly humbled by the support shown by our viewers, and we want to offer our sincere thanks. The truth is that as we have grown our collective, we've struggled to stabilize our financing. And since fundraising is not something that any of us particularly enjoy doing, we are currently facing a fair deal of financial uncertainty. To put it bluntly, we are currently around $2,000 short of our monthly funding goal. So if you enjoy watching our content and want to see more of it, please consider becoming a sustainer for as little as $2 per month or making a one-time donation. Our enemies are well-funded. We are not, so every little bit counts. We are currently in a bit of a transition at Submedia, but we have some big ideas that we hope to turn into a reality in the coming months and years. With your support, we can make that happen and continue producing unapologetically radical content for years to come.